the hole in the bottle and we had to cut it 19 centimeters by 6 for a rectangular shape. I'm coating the bottom of the bottle with rubber cement so I can stick the marbles on it so they won't go away. It's basically like glue. And I'm trying very hard not to touch the edges of where we cut because they can still be sharp and they can cut me. There are 50 marbles in this red cup and in the 2 liter bottle we cut the rectangle in it and we put rubber cement around where we're going to be putting the marbles. So we, the cement was supposed to coat everything together and make it stick. And we did that and it, we put cement where our, the end of the dowel rod is in the bottle. But we held it there for several minutes and it just wasn't sticking. So we came up with an idea just to poke hole, a big hole, in our double sided thermal tape and we stick it in the middle and we taped it across so it can be held steady while the cement is drying. We are now starting the experiment and we are doing it now with no bilge kill and we're trying to find the number of oscillations and the time. And then we're going to add it all up and divide it and find the average. Now, 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 Three, two, one, go. Seven. Okay. And it was five and a half seconds. So we have now just put the bilge kills on the boat, so now we have to go test it in the tub. We are testing with a bilge kill that is 7 cm, and we're counting the number of oscillation and time. 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, it was 1.7. Three, two, one, go. One. 
two, one, go. Stop. Point nine five. Let's go. We are now testing the last one, so we cut off three centimeters of the bilge kill to make it four centimeters extended out where the crease was. So now we have to test that three times. Three, two, one, go. Two. I counted two. All right, three seconds. Three, two, one, go. Stop. One point one. Bearded Dragon on our experimental boat.